I had an elder brother who passed away as a child. It's really kind of indescript how he died. I don't know whether my mother abused him. I don't know whether my father killed him. I don't know if my brother, who's a kind of a liar and a manipulator, did something to harm him because he was insecure in his way. I admit it was hard to grow up in that day when children were abused and beaten when they were, well, a different or difficult or just in the way. I don't have to talk about that because I made a long-term study of relationships and people and how to not become an abuser. I did have to discipline my own son once or twice, but that is a parent's right and a parent's responsibility. We have that biblically sound in the Bible, but nobody goes overboard like some people did on my family and my siblings often got. One of my sisters got it the most, and I could kill my father for that. When he tried to fuck around with me, I stood up to him, and he stopped that because of the black belt that I carry. But the liars of America are cowards. They literally attack you when you're sleeping. What cowards those men are. What cowards those women are. <clears throat> what arrogant son of a bitches that don't belong in America anymore. Go back to Africa where you belong, you little lying slave, because you're trying to believe that you have the right to enslave someone because you stole a cell phone. You're ruining their content. You're destroying your own life and you're not seeing it because the people around you are going to start looking at you going, what are you going to do to me now, you little lying fucking son of a bitch?